Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> so this is kind of part one of my May pickups. Um, these bags were picked up in the last three days. <laughs> it was right after I did what? that rant about the uh, price of video games at the thrift store, and I was like, man, they're so expensive. <laughs> and then actually I got a pretty good deal on these. I had two full 30% off cards. And Lester doesn't even know what's on these. So all these games I'm going to show you 30% off on all of them. Except for the one Salvation Army game, but you'll see that. These pickups were from May 23rd, 2012. This one was from Salvation Army. There's no manual in it. It's an old school Spider-Man game for the Genesis. Uh, two bucks. Same day as that Spider-Man. Found a Game Boy Color. Uh, $5.99 minus 30% off. I was concerned it might not work, but actually it's funny because the battery's still in it. And if you turn it on, it's working. Mario. Super Mario Deluxe. Yeah, oh, that's a good game. It's like Mario 1. It's awesome. Yeah. I got a nice stack of Super Nintendo games. Most of these are going to be Visa. Really should. Super Star Wars, so the Super Nintendo, $3.99. Donkey Kong Country, $3.99. This one's probably going to go on a resale. I only resell... I don't sell for super expensive, and I just want to get more money to buy more video games. That's all. Now this game I don't have in my collection, so I'm happy to have it. Super Adventure Island. I have a big smile on that game. <laughs> Super Adventure <laughs> Island is awesome, awesome game. I just bought this game because I don't have it in my collection, but it's $3.99 for Pinball Dreams. Congo Caper for $3.99. Uh, this game's worth a lot more complete in box, so by itself it's not really worth that much. And they had two copies of Super Mario World. Now these sell pretty good here locally. Vendors at the flea market sell these for about 15 bucks. Retail locally is $21.99. I got these for 4 bucks a pop. Minus 30% off, of course. And I'll probably resell them for like 10 bucks. And just yesterday, I made a video on this one as well when I was out in the wild doing it. Lesser was working. Should have called him sick. <laughs> Look how big the receipt is, <laughs> man. Uh, May 25th, sorry. As you can see right there. It's all minus 30% off. This game looked cool, but I don't think it's that good. It's $4.99 billiard. What is this? Backstreet Billiards. I don't know. It looked kind of cool. There's a little bit of anime characters in the game. I thought it was a two-disker, but it's not. It's just a one-disc. That's just my uh, PS1 guy, if you haven't known yet. Four ninety nine. Black Label Metal Gear Solid. You like this game, Oh, right? man. Shit. Actually, when they made this game, this was the pinnacle. Supposed to be the pinnacle, but Metal Gear was supposed to be on the Nintendo. But, you know, Nintendo being 8-bit and whatever, they couldn't do it. And then this was supposed to more capture the, the vision. true vision of Metal Gear. Did it? Yeah. Oh, man. Like, it's a perfect game. So good. I used to watch Lester play this game and watch him play VR missions all day. It was really entertaining. Uh, this one is from my buddy Rap. He, I know he loves it. Ace Combat 2. Uh, four ninety nine. I don't know. There's a nice hardcore collection of gamers that like Ace Combat games. Four ninety nine. The new Tetris minus thirty percent off. Sorry. There you go. Four ninety nine. And also at the same day, the online version for the Dreamcast was two ninety nine for some reason. There you go. Two ninety nine. And I don't have much Dreamcast games, so this is kind of nice to add to the Dreamcast collection. Support Sega Stoner. Bring back the Dreamcast. Please. Dino Crisis. $4.99 minus 30% off. Uh, kind of the sister to Resident Evil. I still prefer Resident Evil, but this kind of gives me my fix if I want to play that type of game. Instead of zombies, you're killing freaking oh, raptors with a handgun. That go through doors. That go through <laughs> doors! Resident Evil Director's Cut. Definitely one of my favorite games of all time. $4.99. What made this director's cut? There was supposed to be a um, uncut intro. It was basically supposed to be like the Japanese version, like really all uncut. You know, you know how uh, when they released it for the first time, yeah. it was all black and white for some scenes. Yeah. Well, it was supposed to fix that. But Jill, you are the master of unlocking. <laughs> and lastly, I didn't have this in my collection, so I this one kind of irked me. About eight bucks for a game. But it's Mario Superstar Baseball. Mario always makes a good game out of these things. We logged a lot of hours into Mario Tennis for N64. Oh, we <laughs> did, man. Isn't that like the only game you had for the N64? Yeah. Wicked. It's like two-hour lunch sessions. I think we skipped school. <laughs> <laughs> 22.15 was my total for all that. Wow. Good day. That was a good day. Anyways, check out the video for those. Oh, man. 
Oh man, thank you everybody. 201 subscribers last time we checked. Awesome, thank you. It's my kickboxing.